Today we see about logic and proofs from discrete mathematics. So we have five different connectives. So first one negation. The another name for negation is not. Mathematician normally uses two value logics. Every statement is either the form of true or false. A truth table shows how the truth or false of a compound statement. So this is a negation table. Suppose P that is proportion is true. The negation P value is definitely false. Suppose the negation value will get true means the proportion value is false. So uh, another one more example that is statement example. Suppose P is uh, suppose P today is monday that is a true statement then negation p is declared as today is not monday that is false statement next we have the second operation that is and the another name for and is conjunction suppose p uh, priya passed the examination that is a true statement and q arun passed the examination that is also a true statement suppose both p and q are true then we will get the and that is p and q it's nothing but again true value so p uh, uh, that is arun and priya passed the examination so this is a basic uh, table value an example for and next one r the another name for an r is distinction so this is a truth table for r so suppose p that is priya passed the examination so this is a true statement q also a true statement then p r q both are passed the examination that is also true so from the truth table suppose p also true then q also true then we will get the R statement is in the form of true. So this is an example for R. The fourth one, if then. So the another name for if then is conditional. So this is a table for conditional. So suppose uh, P value 3 plus 6 is equal to 10. So this is a false statement. And Q value 2 plus 6 is equal to 9. That is also a false statement. Then P implies Q. That is if 3 plus 6 is equal to 10. 10. Then 2 plus 6 is equal to 9. That is also false statement.